It is important that users of the Laminar Flow Glove Box Isolator, also referred to as an LFGI, have a basic knowledge of several principles that will enable them to safely and effectively use an LFGI for years to come. This video will cover three topics, laminar flow, positive pressure, and negative pressure. Let's begin with laminar flow. LFGIs utilize laminar or unidirectional airflow to prevent cross-contamination. All of the air inside an LFGI passes through a HEPA filter before it enters the work area. The HEPA filter cleans the air by removing airborne contamination such as dust, pollen, and droplets that can harbor spores, bacteria, and viruses. This downdraft of clean air that flows from top to bottom prevents airborne particulates from building up, minimizing the likelihood of cross-contamination and providing the highest level of protection possible. Your LFGI is factory configured for positive air pressure or negative air pressure to control any contamination that may be present inside the work area. Positive pressure describes when the air pressure inside the LFGI is higher than the air pressure in the room. When the air inside the LFGI is under positive pressure, you can see that the air is being pushed out. If a breach of containment, such as a tear in the glove, were to occur when there is positive pressure inside the LFGI, the air inside the unit would flow outward. The outward flow of HEPA filtered air would provide protection for the product inside the LFGI by keeping contaminated air in the room from coming into the work area. Positive pressure is ideal when working with non-hazardous compounds and when protection of the product is of the highest importance. On the other hand, when the room pressure is higher than the air on the inside of the LFGI, the LFGI is under negative pressure. Negative pressure is ideal when working with hazardous drugs and in all situations where personnel protection has been deemed to be of paramount importance. If containment were lost because of a rip or tear in a glove, room air would be sucked into the work area of the LFGI, preventing any of the air that was exposed to the hazardous preparation from leaving the unit. You can see that with the sleeve completely removed, the room air flows into the work area where it is filtered and exhausted. Based on the chemical properties of the products that will be made in your LFGI, air pressure is utilized to maximize patient and employee safety. For more information or to speak with a technical representative at GermFree, call 1-800-888-5357 or go to www.germfree.com.